Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today, we're tackling a question that many Angular developers encounter while working with TypeScript. Our viewer is curious about the target property in the tsconfig.json file. They want to know how it affects their ability to use ES6 features while transpiling to ES5. Let's dive into this important topic and clarify what the target property really means. Welcome back to another technical video. Today we're going to be going through your question, going through some of the answers, and hopefully finding that solution. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy and work through to that resolution. Now, let's get started. Let's start by understanding the target property in your tsconfig.json file. The target property specifies the version of JavaScript that TypeScript will compile to. For instance, if you set the target to ES5, TypeScript will transpile your code to be compatible with ES5 standards, allowing you to use ES6 features in your source code. Now regarding your question about whether target represents the desired output or the syntax to conform to, it actually defines the desired output version. It does not restrict the TypeScript syntax you can use. So you can use ES6 features in your code, and by setting the target to ES5, TypeScript will handle the transpilation for you, ensuring compatibility with older browsers. In summary, Adjust your tsconfig.json by setting the target to ES5 to use ES6 features while ensuring your code runs in environments that only support ES5. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. The target property in tsconfig.json specifies the version of JavaScript that TypeScript will compile to. For example, setting it to ES6 means your TypeScript code will be transpiled into ES6 JavaScript. This target setting also affects library validation during compilation. If you set the target to ES5, it uses the ES5 library, which may not include certain features like array.prototype of find. You can manually specify which libraries to include, allowing you to use newer features even with an older target. For instance, you can include the ES6 library while targeting ES5. And that's it guys. I hope the video has helped find that resolution that you're looking for. And if it did, please hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. Now, until the next time you need a technical video, I hope you have a good one. Cheers. Thank <laughs> you.